think before you spend that money you work so hard for. And if you've got a problem and you can't solve it, write me. I'm Mike Bogoslowski, and I'm in your corner. New tonight, if you grew up in Connecticut, you know that tagline by heart. As we approach our 70th birthday here at News 8, we've been looking back at some of the people who helped shape this television station over the years. Tonight, we check in with an old friend, a scrappy kid from Bristol who touched a whole lot of lives. It's a jungle out there, and if you have a problem, you can always write me. I'm Mike Bogoslowski, and I'm in your corner. For nearly two decades, in the 70s and 80s... I'm Mike Bogoslowski, and you can bet people on my beat, that's what you'll get. He was the growling hero of the little guy here at Channel 8. We came out to a local grocery store to show you exactly what we're talking about. Mike Bogoslowski. Everybody called him Bogey. He made a career out of fixing problems and protecting the people of Connecticut from being ripped off. I'm Mike Bogoslowski, and I'm in your corner. Bogey is now 76 and is recuperating from a broken leg at a rehabilitation center in his hometown of Bristol. He started as a young man helping people with problems in that city. He got a newspaper column and that caught the attention of management here at Channel 8. They called me up and they said, we hear a lot about you. We'd like you on, on, on our air. So you've agreed on a date to have the work done and no one shows up. And Bogey, loud, plain-spoken, get-it-done Bogey, caught on. They were bringing bags of mail. Bags of mail. I read every single letter. And then there was the day that changed his life. The head of a television station from Los Angeles was here back home in Connecticut visiting buddies when he flipped on a TV and saw Bogey. Calls me up and he says, you know what? You are the best thing I've ever seen on television. Bogey went to Hollywood. I like Bogey. I love and I mean your porn. Bogey got more polished, the suits got more expensive, and the scrappy kid from Bristol... I'm not afraid to step on toes. ...made it to the big time. Hey, Bogey, this is Phil Donahue. Phil Donahue. The Phil Donahue. Yes, sir. We're sending a limo down there tomorrow. I always wanted that job. Back at his room in Bristol, yeah. Bogey has scrapbooks and photos of his long career in television. Whoa. And he says he only wants people to remember him for Pictures. one thing. That I care about him. That I love him. And I always will.